Save up on your electricity bill with Solco Solar Water Heaters. I will table the proposal at the cabinet meeting tomorrow to conduct the provincial council elections immediately. The president, prime minister and Basil Rajpaksa have also instructed to do so. The former members of the provincial council met at Temple Trees yesterday. We reached a decision to expedite the provincial council elections. <laughs> We will hold the elections on time. We are not the ones who postponed the election. We are ready for any election at any time. Those who postponed the elections are the ones who are talking about elections now. We were accused of holding elections ahead of schedule. We have not delayed any election, not even by an hour. Meanwhile, a group of former provincial councillors highlighted the importance of provincial councils at a media briefing held today. We will be able to provide a good service in regulating schools and especially the regional hospitals during the COVID-19 pandemic. Some provincial councils have been dissolved for close to three years now. Even during this time, we still visit the villagers. The issue we have is that now, there is no one to coordinate with the preschools in the village. There is no one to coordinate with the village temple to look into the village road network. Under the manifesto of the president, vistas of prosperity and splendor, plans are being made to construct over 100,000 kilometers of rural roads. They are trying to develop the village. We can support this program. We must highlight that the provincial councils must be established soon. For those who call the provincial councils a white elephant, we would like to say that if that is the case, then even the parliament is a white elephant. We don't need so many members in parliament. At the start of the COVID-19 pandemic, the country was controlled by the president and a cabinet of 15 members. Therefore, we don't need 225 members of parliament. The cabinet of ministers alone is enough. That is the answer that we would like to give to people who say that provincial councils are not needed. What is the need for elections right now? The majority of the people in the country are suffering because of the spread of the COVID-19 pandemic. If another election is held, a massive amount of taxpayers' money will have to be spent for it. So this is not an election that the people are asking for. We see this as an election that will provide a mode of income to many political stooges. Even the people in the North and the East are not asking for this election. Even politicians in the North and the East are not asking for this election. Why do these people want to hold this election so badly? Why are they trying to amass so much of power? They were given a two-thirds majority. 6.9 million people voted for the president. They got more power through the 20th Amendment to the Constitution. Now, you want to hold the provincial council elections and secure more power? What are they trying to do? We would like to ask this government if they don't have all the power they need.